Today, Congress honored the women who served as the inspiration for the Hidden Figures movie. And these women helped humans get into space and to the moon during the Jim Crow era. 27 News Washington correspondent Vinay Simlot brings us their story. From the first Mercury, Gemini, and Apollo missions, these four women overcame challenges down on Earth to get humanity to space. In Jim Crow America, there was no evidence to believe that those four black women would have a realistic path to succeed. But they did. Katherine Johnson, Dorothy Vaughn, and Mary Jackson worked in a segregated unit of human computers for the space program. They're the inspiration for the award-winning film Hidden Figures. Dr. Christine Darden was a renowned aerospace engineer and NASA's first black female engineer. They were the mathematical whizzes, these African-American ladies, who made it possible for John Glenn to orbit, who made it possible to go to the moon. On Wednesday afternoon, Congress and Oklahoma Representative Frank Lucas presented the families of Johnson, Vaughn, Jackson and Darden with the Congressional Gold Medal. Every once in a while in the Congress, we get to do something wonderful. The award is Congress's highest honor. The women we honor today made it possible for Earthlings to lift beyond the bounds of Earth. NASA Administrator Bill Nelson talked about their contributions to his agency. They're so strong, NASA's computational research facility bears Katherine Johnson's name. They proved an unassailable fact. Our diversity is a strength. Congress awarded Johnson, Vaughn, and Jackson after their deaths. Their impacts stretched beyond their lifetimes and beyond the planet. Working for you in Washington, Vinay Simlot, 27 News.